Hey guys, what is up? This is Friendly Neighbor News here, back again with another Isaac Breaking Run Capricorn. Why Capricorn? It's not a breaking item. I know. I just want. I have never started a run, I don't think, with an all stats up yet. And Capricorn's a good one. It's a 0.5 damage up, which is incredible. The other stats are a little bit on the low end, but it is a 0.5 damage up, which is sweet. It's one of the highest damage ups of a non-dedicated damage up item. Uh, it and the Pact, I believe, are both in the same boat on that. Uh, I can't get this with one bomb, but we'll, we'll throw two bombs at tinted, tinted rock. Got a small rock. So we're already at five damage per tier, which is incredible. This early on, that's crazy talk. Uh, reason being, Isaac starts at 3.5. Capricorn's a 0.5. Small rock is a 1.0. So, you know, simple arithmetic would lead you to the conclusion that we do five damage per tier. Stem cells is sweet. It's an HP up and a small shot speed up. Which a lot of people don't know that it's actually a shot speed up. People in vanilla were like, man, it's weird. It feels like it's a shot speed up. And then when people actually like looked into it and dug into the files and shit, um, it was a shot speed up. And it has stayed that way for Rebirth. Dry Baby's sweet. As the first familiar, Dry Baby is incredible because now he'll he'll always be one step behind me, essentially like Isaac's heart. And you know how much I get hit when I have Isaac's heart, right? So if I just act normal, um, then Dry Baby should proc a fuck load, like a metric fuck load. Ow! Come on, man. I can see forever. That's actually cool. Should be here. No? Interesting. Got an extra key and a sprit heart. Where's our regular secret room? Must be probably adjacent to our curse room. It's weird. It's a weird spot. Sweet. Getting a bunch of stuff. It's a cool thing. I'll go here first, though. And I'm going to stand still until he charges, which he charged immediately. So that sucks. It sucks my nards. But now I'll just shoot Dry Baby, which is cool. There you go, Dry Baby. Good job. You nailed it. Please. Uh, well, Steven's probably fine, but let's see what's in here. It is a Dark Bum and a Razor. Um, I can't not take Dark Bum. I think I'll reroll Razor into Contract from below, which is great. Grab this. Dark Bum, hurry the fuck up, you slowpoke. Thank you. Go. I believe in you. Spider. So he paid out in three spiders total, two friendly. That's pretty awful payout, but... It's fine by me. Where the fuck? Huh? Huh? That's bizarre. That's just downright weird, but alright. Jason to two special rooms. It's a one. <laughs> nah. I'm not even going to risk going to pick up the coinage. So that, would, that would put me in danger of re-rolling my run, which I fucking love. Like, this run, I'm actually in love with this run right now. It's so good. Um, mm, mm, yeah. Let's buy this and curse the maze for giving me my, uh, my daily disorientation. Or dissertation, I guess. Um... Let's go on. Let's move along. Curse of the Blind is not great, but there's not a lot of items that I could pick up that I wouldn't be okay with picking up. I'd be alright with soy milk. Dr. Fetus would probably be the worst one. Fuck. Dr. Fetus, I think, would be the one that I would be upset about. Everything else I'd be pretty alright with. Range down. I'll take it with me in case there's a PhD. I 
I mean, if I get, like, an actual, you know, thing that'll go on queue, whether it be a tarot card or a pill or whatever else, then I'll obviously ditch range down. But, in the event that that doesn't happen, you know, might as well hold on to it for a potential PhD. Uh, let's not bother with the shop yet, because we don't really have the cash. Fuck you. Okay. Alright, let's not talk about that one, alright? You can talk about all the other damage all you want, but that one, let's just let's sweep it under the rug and never happen, alright? Alright, I have taken so much damage against Dark One. This is fucked up, dude. I don't know what's wrong with my brain today. Box. That's actually really nice. The devil. Yeah, I mean. Speed up is sweet. Devil's better than a ranged downgrade pill, so. Let's tag it with us, I guess. Box is not exactly what I was looking for, but it's okay. It's like very kind of middling sort of an item. I just almost fucking soaked a bullet in the head. Thank you, contract from below, for being based. Yep, contract from below, keep it up, bud. The halo, that's sweet. Another all stats up is always good. Smart fly. Alright. That's probably, when I saw Fly, I was like, oh, please don't be Best Bud. But then I remembered that Best Bud doesn't have Fly in the name, and, or even in the subtext. Like, it literally, Best Bud is just Best best Bud. Uh, yeah, Pushpin's better. Pushpin's interesting. It's, um, I don't know, it's a weird item. It's like, you have a chance of firing a, sick, a piercing plus spectral tier. Which is interesting. Um, let me check up here. Okay. So it could be here. I don't think it is, so. Yeah. So I'm pretty sure it's only gonna be here. Yep. Some coinage. Let's go check out our shop, I guess. Now that we've gotten to this point. So yeah, push fin. It's just it's a pretty sweet trinket. Right, I forgot that we have Curse of the Blind again. Fuck. And by again, I mean like still, because I, you know, I didn't leave this floor. Let's buy it. All right, remote detonator is probably the best thing I could have bought there. Huh? The jar is horseshit. Oh, goose, your donation machine. I know. You're not wrong. I need to start doing runs that'll give back. The compass. Alright. You know what? I'll take it. Uh, you know what? I'll also... Take that. Fuck. Took some extra damage. You know, not proud of it. It's fine. Really was hoping that, that would have been fate, or, I don't know, like a good payout. No kind of a penny. Can you stop spawning these, please? Sloth, you sack fuck. Uh, can you please suck a fuck? How does one suck a fuck? Two diamonds. I will carry this with me. Ooh. Alright. I don't know what's causing all these spirit hearts and apparently eternal hearts to drop, but I'm not upset about it.
Okay, this room's kind of annoying. I really wish that this was a room that actually had shit in it. Okay. Am I just that fucking lucky today? Like, the first run I recorded today <laughs> was the last run you guys saw. And, uh... Let's just say that that run, if I didn't get the amount of fucking spirit heart things that I got, that run would have died like a million times over. It would have died in the chest, which I, I was talking about it. I don't remember if I was actually talking about it in an episode, but I was talking, at the very least, I was talking to somebody about the idea of losing a run to the that makes it to the chest, which I've never experienced that. And it seems almost impossible that it would happen. Like, you made it to the fucking chest, you're automatically gonna be super strong. Like, you get so many extra items there, right? It's weird. But yeah, last run, I would've, I would've lost it on the chest if it weren't for the fact that uh, I had fucking Relic Dark Bum Miter and shit. So I'm taking store credit with me because I would like to utilize it to buy something from the shop while not losing coinage and or two of diamonds because then potentially in the future I'll get more usefulness out of that. Who knows? We'll see. We'll see what goes down. Okay. These rooms are a pain in the ass. The triple shot or the... I always say triple shot. The red, like... Here's the weird thing, right? Wall spiders are always triple shot, aside from the fucking brimstone. But the the spread shot, there you go. The spread shot spiders are fucking dumb. PhD? Blank card, though. Oh, God, what do I do? I want both. You know what? Let's buy PhD using store credit. Range up is sweet. I want to hold on to two of diamonds, but I do want the blank card. I should go back for push pin at some point. Whew. Let's find our item room ideally though. Before anything else. Or our you know, boss room. I just want to get use out of the D6 before I fucking ditch it for blank card and have another run where we have nothing with blank card for like the whole run. Dude, the amount of runs that I have blank card in is pretty high. But then the amount of runs that I have Jera in is like also pretty high. But the amount that I have both in is like fairly fucking low. <laughs> and it's not cool. Um, good news is, because we fought Chad, we get the Dark Bum old Chad interaction, which is sweet. Got Lump of Coal, which is great. So, every three rooms, little Chad will give us a kiss, which will give us a half red heart, which means every nine rooms, Dark Bum will pay out once. Right, that's the shop. Okay. And that's assuming no other red heart drops whatsoever, which is still reasonable. Every nine rooms getting a payout is, like, pretty good. It's not, like, incredible. It's, like, it's fine. Magic Mush, maybe? Nope. Oh, this is a room that I don't like. Well, I kind of like it, actually. Why is Dry Baby not proccing, dude? Oh, my God, Dry Baby, you suck shit. Oh, thanks! Thanks, dude! Fucking, you suck. That's pretty much what I expected. Uh, yeah, let's... Ah, uh, we can get four if we put it there. No pills at all. That's not good. No pills at all. No pills?! Holy shit. One pill. One singular fucking pill. <laughs> That's fucking dumb. Alright, so this is awkward. I think what I have to do is take blank card, use blank card, drop blank card, buy battery, go back, reroll bean. This is Caves 1, right? No, this is Caves 2. Fuck! There's like no more anythings. Spoonbender's awesome. 
There's no more fucking shrooms, dude. It means magic mushrooms are dead. That's not entirely true. Secret rooms can still happen. And then we'll take blank card with us. I guess we'll buy this fucking thing. Yeah, sure, it's a health up. That's sweet. This is like the only shrooms left, so let's blow them up. Wow! The Nintendo Wow! Uh, yeah, Mom's Pearl ain't bad. Shouldn't decrease the chance of other things spawning, so. Oh well, that floor sucked shit. Somewhat. Can I stop getting curses though? This is absurd. It's like I'm playing hard mode. I'm not playing hard mode, by the way. So it was. <coughs> it was ugh. Fucking grimbly grumbly. Uh, so Spoonbender with Lumbagold is great. I mean, uh, to be honest, I I legitimately think Spoonbender might be the greatest item in Rebirth that gets no credit. Like, it gets credit when, um, you know, when you have it with fucking Brimstone, right? That's when people are like, oh, yeah, Spoonbender. But, like, outside of that... Fucking nobody talks about this item. Uh, there. And it's sad because I think this item is incredible. That should hit the skull. It did. No tarot cards. Rip. I and mean, this is this is depths. So like, there should be a lot of skulls. Hopefully. I don't know. I think Depths has less skulls than Necropolis, though, which sucks. Oh well. Hopefully, I get at least one more damage up, because I'm I'm definitely feeling our damage falling off a little bit. Not exactly like falling off. I guess just it it feels a little on the low end, which is like almost the fucking definition of falling off, right? Curse the Blind, Tiny Planet. Well, you know what? We already had Lumbacle. I'm actually happy with this. And we have a reasonable tier rate, so... You know what? This is good. I'm glad it happened. I'm taking that one, Darkbone. It's not, not your... Not yours, today. Okay. I almost blew that fucking bomb in a weird direction. Yeah, this is also mine. You'll get the all the rest one, rest of them. Um, I also should have thought about the usage of my blank card with two diamonds. That's okay. It's not like it matters. Why is it every run has monster two now? Monster's law is fucking horseshit, dude. I fucking hate monster's law. Like I don't even get monster's law in the fucking basement slash cellar or whatever. It's only on fucking this shit. So we have Spoonbender, Tiny Planet, Lump of Coal, which is incredible. Torn Photo is so good. We're pretty powerful now. Yeah, I'm, I'm digging where this run's headed. Definitely a fan. Woo! Dark Bomb! Woo! It was pretty incredible, that room. Let's check this out. We have one Guppy item, so... Yeah, Guppy's head, there's two. So we're one away from becoming Guppy. Becoming Guppy on this run would pretty much... I'd say, I'd say that would probably seal the deal. It's not really an item I want. There's a creep there. Don't walk on that creep. Um, well that's it, right? Ooh. Oh no, there's... fuck. There's more. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot! I should blow up skulls. I have bombs, but let's explore first. Yeah, this is a spot that I want to use bombs. 
don't like that though. Ah, mm, you know what? I'm glad I soaked it because there was a tinted rock there, so it worked out. I have to like fucking try really hard to make sure to say tinted rock so it doesn't come out as titted rock. You know, that's the issue with our generation is that we just kind of say shit, right? That like sounds reasonable to us, but in reality we're like, we're slurring our speech. We're slurring the speech a lot. Sorry if you have a lisp and that offended you. But like, yeah, we, we, we slur our speech like a shitload and people just don't know what the fuck we're saying. Hell, we probably don't even know what we're saying. Starter deck, I was about to say that's like pretty bad because we have PhD. But honestly, because we have blank card, that's fine. Bible. Well, Bible's gone then. That's nice to know. Um, dicks. Where are our secret rooms? Should be here? No. Then it's adjacent to our item room. Yep. It's still a fucking weird spot. Greed. Greed's fine. Greed's actually quite good. This'll get us our money back from spending all of it on the shop when we had Curse of the Blind because I'm a fucking moron or something. Um, there's our super secret room. Ooh, I will spend some money here. If I get Cancer Trinket, then we, like, auto win, so. It's my main rationale for doing this. The moon to a club. Just pop it. Jera! We in there. Chariot. Okay. Well, but we're in there. So, we have Jera blank card. Um, hopefully next floor shop has things in it. I shouldn't have stood there. Um, I should have just gone down to the next floor and not let him pay out yet. Oh well. So our shop will not have greed because there's a mini boss here, which is incredible. So now we actually get... Did you guys see that? At the top left of the screen. One of my tears just fucking soared so far off the screen that it looked like a fucking asteroid coming in. That was bizarre. This should pay out. Yep. Um, so there's a mini boss. Can't have greed in our shop, which is great. Excuse me. Which means that hopefully our shop has a battery. If our shop doesn't have a battery, then fucking I'm so sad. All right, that's pretty good. Empress is not really what I'm looking for. Uh, let's go to our item room first because it's right here. What am I doing? Control bombs, so let's just throw that down. Fill that up. Lucky Foot is quite the item. <clears throat> I like Lucky Foot a lot, as you probably know. Luck upgrades are, I'd say, severely underrated. There is a battery. Awesome. So, we get to go real ham here. Like, mega ham. Ultra ham. Um, I'm gonna buy this, and I'm gonna pop it. It's Emperor. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna... Yeah, okay. This is awkward, because this room has shit in it. We need to, um... What's, what's happening in my brain? How do I drop items? Is it, it's left control, right? Okay. My brain just, it shut down. I don't know what happened there. Alright, so that's out of the way. I also want to get this heart out of the way, as well as get at least one coin on the ground. There's a coin on the ground, so. Now let's get this heart out of the way. Um, well, first we need to also get this card out of the way. So we need to bomb this at least once, I think. Let's go back here. I'll play this blood bank a bit so we can have money for the heart as well as, you know, have the potential of buying the heart. 
by missing HP. Actually, that's enough, yeah. <coughs> okay. <coughs> so buy the heart, buy this, justice, which is sweet. Um, yeah, we can leave the rest of this shit on the ground, that's fine. Now we just need to get charge on our blank card, and then we get to go ham. So one more room. Let's do this room. Hopefully it's not just a pass-through. It's just a pass-through. It's fine. We'll drop a bomb here. We'll drop a bomb here. In fairness, our consumables don't fucking matter, considering we're about to get 99 of all of them. Thanks to blank card Jera in the shop. Okay. So we are pretty much set this one, I think. So back to the shop we go. And even though it's only one battery, this works just fine. For some reason, now we have three, right? That's how fucking math works. So, so this is the scary part. Ready? Woo! <laughs> All right. You know what? Let's just keep doing it a little bit. Just make sure we get 99. One more time. That should be good. We're we're at 99 now, for sure. Wee! There's the coins. There's the keys. Bombs. Where? It's like not a lot of bombs actually. Rip bombs. That's fine. I think 68 is roughly 100. So. All right, so that went well, as you can probably, you know, understand. Um, secret room probably is here. Nope. Okay. Secret room is probably here then, considering there's two skulls here. Yep. Okay, that's just coins, that sucks. Check this out. We have so we have infinite health. It's I should have doubled these, but that's okay. We're guppy anyway. I don't know why I didn't double. Like we have batteries everywhere. It's not like it matters though. We didn't get anything aside from fucking. Well, fuck. No. All right. I'm a moron. I should have doubled the fuck out of that. Want to know why? Because that's an item red chest that we were doubling there. Fuck. <laughs> that means we would have been digging into the item room pool. Ah, uh, god damn it. I'm a moron, dude. I'm a fucking idiot. Don't do what I did. Fool. I mean, yeah, let's just use two of diamonds and then take Jera Fool. Um, yeah, we're too slow. That's okay. Not the most upset. Can get these bombs now. Mm, actually, we can play this blood bank until we can visit our boss gauntlet room. So let's go check that bitch out. Iron chest. Well, Fuck. <laughs> that sucks. <clears throat> Unfortunately, if it were like triple red or double gold or something like that, I would have done it. But iron chest is not necessary considering I have 99 of everything forever. So, Good thing we are super ultra strong, so nothing really matters to me. Wow. This is actually fucking wild. Um, yeah, I mean, I'd be dumb not to take both these, so. Alright, we're good. Let's move along. I don't actually know the words, I'm sorry. Sorry if I offended any 
All American Rejects fans. To be honest, I, I like that song. So. <laughs> Oops. No. No. Okay. 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 No. Why do I like that song? I don't fucking know. <laughs> it's just I don't know. It's a catchy song, I guess. Um, so I'm looking for secret room. Basically, my main priority right now is find the secret room. That's a full payout in one room drop. Alright. Gimpy. Gimpy's pretty good. No payout, that's fine. This could be sweet. What are you? A yoker. Let's use the yoker. Goat head. It's a little bit too little too late. Sorry. Alright. There's also a tinted rock there that we will get uh, when we're blowing open some chests. I have dodged like a god. I do want to find a secret room that has double battery though. Um. So flat penny is beyond useless, <laughs> considering we have you know 99 of both of the things that it it does stuff with, or stuff related to. I guess it does stuff with one of them r based uh, that well relate that. Mm. All right, <laughs> let's, let's just continue onward and ignore that train of thought entirely. It wasn't a worthy train of thought. Um, there should easily be four rooms left. Oh, we're fighting Mr. Fred. Blit. 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 So, let's double this, and then let's not double anymore until we can confirm that there is not a battery in any room. If we confirm there's no batteries, then we'll double it again, and then blow it all open. Um, but I believe that there's a reasonable chance of there being a battery somewhere, so... Not gonna give up hope quite yet, more or less. So far, we actually haven't found a single spot that could be the secret room. I don't think. Actually, it could be here. I think. Okay. Not battery. Okay. Well, that's one place. Basically, now we're just hoping for a champion. And also, we're really hoping this is an item chest. If it's not, I'll be a little salty. Not that salty though. So yep, there should be no batteries dropped. We already have the box, so it definitely can't. And the box doesn't even drop a battery. Yeah, there's no more battery. There's no way to get batteries, so let's just go with eight. Uh, let's shove them around so we can actually blow more up with less bombs, even though we don't need to min max at this point. I fucking feel like it. Should blow up all of them, minus the one on the left, probably. Alright, well, you know what? The chest was more or less worth it, considering we, we net positive bombs. <laughs> Wasn't an item chest, though, which, you know, it sucks a little bit. A little, a little peeved. Double gate, so it's not Mr. Fred. I mean, double gate's pretty fucking easy, so <laughs> I'm not gonna complain or anything. Squeezy! More tears up. Tears to Apu. Let's move along. I'm sorry. I need to stop. Let's hope for cancer. We have 99 cents. There's a reasonable chance that we get cancer. Or there's not a chance at all. So you're telling me there's not a chance. Well, that sucks. <laughs> I finally get a fortune teller, and I'm like, oh, this is great. Cancer. Nope. Uh-uh. Not today. Just 
just want to find a secret room that has a battery in it. Is that too much to ask? This has a battery, though. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. All right. Drop your fucking drop out here. All right. There's no drop. Sweet. So we get to create a battery room. Battery room. Battery room. Now we just need to hope we can find something worth, you know, doubling a trillion times. Which doesn't seem unreasonable. Let's just double one more time. Ensure that we've got infinity batteries for all, ever and always. Might be tough to traverse this room, though. That might have been a mistake. That's fine. We'll just kind of wiggle our way in. Okay. Uh, let's go this way. How do we get... Oh, there's a blood bank. That's right. Okay. Alrighty. So that'll let us get into that room. It's just an iron chest. What do we got? Yeah. We should fight the room first, though. Okay. So I've concluded that our red chest is not an item chest. Our golden chest is still up in the air, though. And we haven't opened it yet, so we're good. Make sure nothing else exists on the floor. Holy shit. Make sure Dark Bump pays out out here. Okay, so now, I mean, we can just go to these uh, couple adjacent rooms and double it without having to backtrack that far. What are you? Two O diamonds. That's pretty useless. Alright, so now we we'll get Jera ready. Double. More adjacent rooms. Okay. Do 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 do. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Ba da ba 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 ba. So unfortunately we're going to get a fuck ton of spirit hearts. Well, fortunately or unfortunately. I actually shouldn't have picked up the keys. Fuck. Hopefully a key drops in a different room somewhere. At some point. Yeah, there's no keys on the ground. Fuck. I fucked up. Because these are golden chests, which means that, you know, <laughs> it'll take uh, it'll take a, f you know, a number of keys to open them. Let's uh, check now. Not an item chest. All right, well, let's just open a few. Get some of these bams. Get ourselves to 99 bams. Short on the keyage, that's okay, though. I don't think there's any payouts from the vending machines that would want me to double. Keys, like, sure, but not really, so. Wiggle, 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 yeah. Hey, look, another battery room, potentially. That's cool. Well, that was a boring floor. We got the, we got multiple battery rooms, but we didn't do shit. We just didn't have the opportunity to do shit, I guess. Rip. Thank you, drive, baby. Hey, Dark Bomb, you want to grab that one? Sack of shit. Alright, this is where we can really get get going with this, this shit. Shit, that wasn't good, good at all. Hey, Dark Bomb, can you fucking grab this? You buttle. So, we don't have D6, so, like, restarting the room a million times won't do anything. Which is fine. Wait, how did he not pay out? He picked up three half-red hearts. Does he- he must- you know what? He probably doesn't keep, you know, the payout or whatever between floors. I honestly think that must be it. 
Because that's happened so many times, it can't just be a fucking RNG or, you know, something weird like that. Yeah. So this is going to be kind of rough, because we're going to throw away a lot of spirit hearts. But, it'll pay off if that's an item chest, or one of those is an item chest. Which I think is a reasonable expectation. And then if we ever get a battery room, um, then we're great, because then we'll just not pick up the next Spirit Heart Dark Bomb drops, and get infinite Spirit Hearts that way, which will allow us to infinitely go into that room, and infinitely duble chests, which will infinitely allow us to infinitely get more infinite items. I really want Dark Bomb to pay out at a point that I, like, understand he's paying out. <laughs> so I don't accidentally pick it up, or block myself by having it stuck in a door. I mean, we have 99 bombs, so I can shove it out of the way if I need to. Battery? Not battery. Yoker? Uh, yeah, let's just see what these are. Emperor, Devil, Yoker. Yoker. I'll take the paw and definitely use it. it seems sweet. Uh, what was the other one I had? Fool, Devil, Emperor. I guess Devil... I mean, Emperor is probably the best out of them, so I'll take that. So let's hopefully find a battery room. I really want a battery room. <laughs> that wasn't, you know, incredibly clear. I don't want to pick that up, actually. Okay, we have our spirit heart. We know where it is. Now we just need a battery. Uh, yeah, there's definitely three rooms left, so let's go back and double again. This time that we double, let's open two chests. Just so we can see if one of them is, in fact, an item chest. It is not. Although, you know what? It's, it's troll bombs and spirit hearts. It's funny. All right, now that blows a little bit. Little bit, that's okay. We can still do some breaking before the chest, maybe. Probably not. I mean, we, we still have blank card Jera, so we're gonna get a trillion chests on the chest, so. Whatever. And I'm picking that up because I don't ever need to go back into the curse room. Alright. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we're going to get anything. This looks pretty done. Thank you, Dark Bomb. You're a real stand-up guy. Oh, they're not all dead? Oh, there's one left, okay. Do these ever hit? Yeah... Do some of them not? No, these all hit, actually. Holy shit. That's sweet. I like this strat. Rip Isaac, holy shit. Dark Bomb, grab that one as well. Yeah, there you go. Meet me down there. Uh-oh. I doubled the Spirit Heart. Uh-oh. <laughs> that room is going to get pretty full pretty quick. It's not great. We have some luck though, so actually, we, there's a reasonable chance that a chest, uh, just a regular old chest, will find its way into our fucking pockets. And that would be an ideal room to double. I should have left the keys. Fuck! I'm stupid sometimes. Or all the time. Keys? 
Well, this is gonna be an interesting situation. I shot all the fire. I could have just fucking hit myself on the fire to pick up these fucking spirit hearts. God damn it. It's fine. I can still kind of do that. I just need to find a room and get hit four fucking times. One! Two! Man, I wish I didn't shoot the fire. Three! Four. Alright, we did it. Now kill him. Ooh, kill him. Okay. So now, we pick up these spirit hearts. Because, you know, stop doubling them, you fucking moron. Ow. Okay. So I will... Uh, I don't know. I'm trying to think of... Because there's a chest that's right by the door, and I don't want to deal with that. Dark Bum, you got this. Thank you, bud. Alrighty. Now, I think we'll just try to find a secret room in general and hope it has a battery. Mostly. That's what I want. Alright, this room is good too. It's good to know about. I'll leave the keys. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. Let's open a couple. Let's pop, pop some of these bad boys open. Quarter's fine because it's, you know, passive. Pisces is good. Bum friend's good because we don't need money anymore. These are all good. The only thing that wasn't good is Box of Spiders. Strength card, okay. Well, we need to actually drop the Strength card over here, or just use it. Actually, that removes the Spirit card. That wasn't smart. Whatever. So we're pretty powerful now, <laughs> um, if we weren't before. We are fucking ridiculously power now. Uh, we can probably use this room to... Yeah, no fucking fuck. Fuck shit, fuck. Alright, well... We can get a fucking magic mush or something. Or a mini mush. Mini mush is good. Justice. Yeah. The moon. Uh, okay. And the sun. That's not exactly useful. Stuff doesn't really do much. I don't think keys. <coughs> oh god, I can't talk today, apparently. I don't think keys are gonna be a huge issue. I'm glad that this was the room with the shitty shit. Uh, yeah, double our bombs, sure. Wait, why did I go to an extra room? That was not smart. Yeah, whatever, let's just pick up these keys. Double. Open some more passive. Oh, god. These are some HP upgrades that I do not want to be a part of. I will take Odd Mushroom, though. It's an HP upgrade, but it's it's, it's good. One equals power is great. Uh, I'm not going to take Monsters long. Am I? You know, fuck it. This runs ridiculous. How fast? Yeah, charge is real fast. Oh, no. The range is so bad. No. I've made a mistake. Holy shit, I made a horrific mistake. I thought that we were gonna have range! Oh no. Oh no! Oh no. <laughs> I mean, like, our damage is so absurd. I shouldn't have taken this. Fuck. <laughs> I've, I swear I've had monsters long before with, like, Tiny Planet, and it's never been this shitty. I can't even imagine it actually being this shitty. I mean, it is, so... I don't have to imagine, I guess. Uh, so we have one last double after this one, so... Let's just do it. Let's, let's max out our chestage. I mean, like, we one-shot, like, enemies and shit. Like, that's cool, I guess. 
objects. Holy what? Hey, look, water. Just got some fucking water. Apparently we're thirsty or something. I should stop fucking taking hits. This is not great. I mean, there's spirit hearts all over, so it's not like the end of the world or anything. Cool. Alright, so now what we'll do is we'll pick up these spirit hearts. And then go back to there, and then blank card plus pop Jera. And uh, hopefully we have enough keys. Yes, Dexter's remote is not an item I want at all. We're not going to have enough keys, by the way. I'm just, just throwing that out there. Libra's probably good. The fuck is that? <laughs> we have chests stacked on top of each other. What the fuck? This is actually really silly looking. Holy shit, I love the way this looks. This is very funny. No, I'm trapped. <laughs> oh, there's a relic here. Get out of there and come back in. I guess we won't pop the jar in. I don't want to take mom's knife because that'll ruin everything. And it's shit. That's probably not a good pickup in this situation. I don't know why I did pick it up. Holy mantle's sweet. Passives, please. Not HP, though. Okay. <laughs> I, yeah, okay, we got HP, whatever. It happened. Excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse, excuse me. Yeah, I guess I can hold on to that. Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, get me out of here. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Alright. Let's get through here, alright. Quad shot, thank you. Infestation, sure. Mulligan, yep. I don't know what. No, there's only one thing there, okay. That, yep. Chemical peel, sure, yep. Uh huh. These are also passives. There's a polyphemus, which is bad with Libra, so I'm not gonna grab it. How do I get out of here? I don't get out of here! Let me out of here! Uh oh. Alright. Alright. <laughs> Excuse me. Pardon me. Alright, pull some. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Pull some chests over here. Uh, okay. Uh oh. Oh no! No! Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Why, did I, why am I taking all this shit? We're out of keys. Oh no! We got the butter bean though. Oh no! Why do we have a fart jetpack? Don't we have Monster's Lung? We shouldn't be firing. Oh, because Dr. Fetus probably doesn't work with Monster's Lung. Okay. That's all we got. We're done for. Out of it. Alright, any more passives that we can grab? No? Uh, skinny on Mushroom we can. And then we will grab the... I mean, there's a, you know, there's a couple passives. But not gonna bother. Um, yeah. Not gonna bother with, uh, you know, the rest of this shit. Just fart jetpack our way around. 
pretty good. I think this fart jetpack is like a bit stronger than uh, previous fart jetpack. Like a little bit. I don't know, it's close. Blood of the Martyrs, pretty alright. Nice, we got more keys. Alright, it's pretty garbage, but. What are you? A two of diamonds. There's a lot of two of diamonds cards so in this run. I don't know how I feel about it. Excuse me. Pardon me. Coming through. Thank you. Is it dead? <laughs> I saw a spider, guys. Mother Bobby, sure. I love how every run ends up with you just having fucking an entire, like, army of familiars. It's pretty great. High Priestess, sure. It's a little bit better than Two of Diamonds, I guess. Which is to say that, you know, it, it does something. Sad bombs are actually. Do that? Does that work? I don't, yeah, I don't think it works. Of course, guillotine. When a, when a run gets fucky, you know, you gotta go full fuck mode. Let's see what a bomb looks like. What does this do? Oh. Cool. It's actually like pretty fucking sweet. Sorry. <laughs> because we're Lord of the Flies, the fucking Duke killed himself instantaneously. That's funny. Well, unfortunately that runs over. Alright, how fast does fucking move- oh, okay. <laughs> well, that was a fun one. Um, I don't know what to say other than holy shit, fire chip back! We didn't get fire mine though. Let's uh... Oh, what was it? What's this? A dog azurin. Alright. Here's, here's the plan. Uh, let's put it actually in this big room. Why is the peeper, like, constantly popping? Oh god, no! <laughs> like... <laughs> Gotta wait on that bomb cooldown. So let's just do, like, 20. I don't fucking care about crashing it. I just want to see some pretty fucking colors. Oh my god! <laughs> that is incredible. Excuse me, I want to get this one. Here. Excuse me, pardon me. Coming through. Get me out of the corner! There we go. Well, that was fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Uh, if you did, leave a like. And, uh, oh yeah, let me just talk about this. I, I don't know how many people actually stay past the end of a run. But, uh, if you are here and you're you're listening to me, uh, I, I want to propose an idea of a part of the series. Because, you know, as you know, breaking runs, breaking runs are cool. They're, they're neat, but if I did nothing but breaking runs, like actual breaking run attempts, rather than just occasionally doing like cool tier effects and shit, um, it'd be pretty stale, right? Like it would get, it wouldn't be that exciting. So that's why I do the extra stuff. But even that might actually get a little stale. So the idea I had was basically a hardcore Isaac. So I would like go to this file, right? 
and I would do new run, and I would try to do every unlock possible. I mean, this file apparently I already did shit. Or is Lazarus default unlocked? I don't know. Um, right, so I would I would do a full file with one win streak, right? No deaths, hardcore Isaac. If I die, wipe the save, right? That would be the idea. Um, let me know if that sounds interesting. Uh, I, I'm considering it. I don't know if people actually would be into it, but um, yeah. Once again, thanks for watching, uh, and uh, leave your leave your idea of that or leave your impression of that in the comments so I can know what to do. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.